I'll uh, keep on track. Anyways, good morning, Double R Radio, live on Facebook right now. Thursday morning! And, uh, well, uh, it is time for celebrity birthdays, and then we're going to talk about this, we're going to talk about that, we'll talk about sex, we'll talk about everything, it's really well! <laughs> Anyways, I made myself some cafecito. 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 There we go. Uh, who's that? Uh, there's my daughter right there. You know, Mika's always poaching. I'm going to say, Mika, you're poaching too much. Good morning, shout out to Angel out of Corpus Christi in the house. Angel, um, I want to go to Corpus. I want to go fishing this time. I'm going to take my rod and reel. I'm going to be packing my rod and reel. You know what I mean? It's the, um, I know, I know. But anyways, I'm going fishing, Angel. I need to, I need, you know, let me know if you know some good fishing spots, all right? Because I want to do some fishing in Corpus. Good morning, shout out to Maria Lopez. Maria's all chiflada right now because I'm playing her radio, Drata Maria. Don't I sound so cool, Robert? Yes, you do, Maria. You sound very good. Robert, are you going to make me a star? Yes, I'm going to make you a star, Maria. Are you sure, Robert? Yes, I am, Maria. Are you going to want a percentage, Robert? Yes, I am, Maria. 20%. Okay, Robert, I'll give you 30%. Okay, give me 40%. I'll give you 50%. Whatever you want, Maria. Give me whatever you want. There you go. <laughs> Man, my coffee's kicking butt. It really, really is. I put some tequila in there. Coffee with tequila, I'm telling you. Anyways, ah, que lindo cafecito. Anyways, uh, do y'all see this right here? Y'all, can y'all see that? My little trencita. Is it too long? You know, I've never asked. I've never asked a woman, "Is it too long?" But I gotta ask you, is it too long? You know, I sound kind of weird saying that, don't I? Especially for the people who aren't watching me on 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 you know this live crap right now. But I gotta ask you one more time. Is it too long? Because it'd be different if I was standing up and saying, is it too long? But I'm not doing that. This is a family show, so let me turn around again. Is it too long? <laughs> right. Ah, there's my grandbaby, baby Mia. Papa, keep it clean. We're listening to you in first grade. Okay, Mika, I'm sorry, baby Mia. My grandbaby, man, she disciplines me. She really, really does. Good morning, said I got to Cindy Martinez Hernandez. I'm in Maria Lopez. Cynthia, go. Oi, Cynthia. What's the deal, Cynthia? You're vice president of Robert Rivas Radio. What's your problem, Cynthia? You're supposed to wake up and get, you know, help me get the morning started and control the, the crowds and everything. Cynthia, good morning, shout out going to Ida Mendoza. I mean, checking me out. There we go. Anyways, uh, <laughs> uh oh, Cindy Martinez and Dennis says, it's too long, Robert. You know, I've never had a girl tell me it's too long, man. Anyways, <laughs> there we go. Cynthia Gonzalez Ramirez says, it's not too long. My primo, oye primo, you know, let me tell you something about my primo. Está bien chiflado mi primo. Bien chiflado mi primo. He sends me a message, hey, primo, I'm at Bill Miller's having a brisket and egg taco with biscuits and coffee, todo. Come on, primo, come on, dude. Come on, it's not it's not cool to kick a man when he's down, primo. Come on, dude. Michelle Ramirez Williams says it's too short. Hey, uh, nobody was talking about your husband there, Michelle. But doom, no, not funny. Okay. <laughs> uh, Maria Lopez says she wants a pork chop. Oh no, she's saying she wants chop chop. There we go. Anyways, I tell you what, let's knock out celebrity birthdays. Let's see what celebrities are celebrating their birthday today. What's today? April the 13th, those me and the SEC at the Let's see what celebrities are celebrating their birthdays. Here we go. Thomas Jefferson. You know, the guy on your uh, $20 bill? The $20 bill? Yeah. He would have been celebrating his birthday today. There we go. Who else is celebrating birthdays? Let me see here. Uh, I don't know who in the hell that is. Who in the hell's that? Let me see here. I'm kind of looking here. I don't know who that is either. Bam, 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 bam. There we go. Ron Perryman, 67 years old. Al Green. R&B. I didn't know he was still alive. Wow, Al Green, 71 years old. Pretty cool. Uh, let me see here who else is celebrating birthdays. I'm looking here. Um, bam, ba -dee -dee -ba -dee -na 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 -na. That's it. That's all I know on celebrity birthdays. Let me see here. I got a story for you guys here. But before I get to my story, let me see here. Michelle Ramirez Williams is laughing a lot because I said her husband has small pee pee. There you go. You know, y'all women, man. Why is it that y'all women right away? Why is it that when women right away break up with a guy? Right away, y'all want to attack us and go, you know, <laughs> you're talking to your girlfriends. You know, I'll use me for an example. I'll, I'll use myself. I'll be the guinea pig. Right? Right? A girl breaks up with Robert Rivas, and she's telling her girlfriends, I broke up with them. I broke up with when she didn't really break up with me. I broke up with her. But, you know, she, she, she can say what she wants. I broke up with them. 
Oh, why did you break up with her? Why? And I'm over here being all innocent, and she's going to throw in a, well, he has my pee pee. I mean, right away, women want to attack us. Come on, hey, man. Please. Right away, man. <laughs> Either you're going to talk about it, or you want to cut it off. It's one or the other. Come on, man, leave us alone. <laughs> really? I'm not, I'm not playing about that. You know, no lie, back in the day, this is true. Back when I was a sophomore in high school, I can't use the word date, because we weren't dating, but we we're both going to school, right? And there was this girl. She was very in love with me. This is true. I'm not making this up. She was all in love. I never kissed her. I never touched her. I just looked at her, and she fell in love with me. I mean, hey, man. Hey, man. But anyways, she used to go up to my buddies, and, she, and she'd call me Bobby Rivas, and she would go, and she would tell my buddies, where's Bobby Rivas? And they go, uh, we don't know. Do you know when Bobby Rivas is going to be back? Uh, we don't know. Uh, do you know what class he has next? We don't know. She would always call me Bobby Rivas. I'd be at the cafeteria eating, and she'd just be looking at me. She goes, how you doing, Bobby Rivas? And I go, man, leave me alone. She goes, Bobby Rivas, do you want to go to the driver with me? I don't have a car. I have a man. No, Bobby Rivas doesn't want to go out with you. Leave me alone. I'm serious. This girl wouldn't leave me. And this is without me touching her, kissing her, um, um, Saying it Mexicano, metendo la mano? Nada! I never did nothing to her, man! I can only imagine, right? So anyways, uh, one day, no lie, out of the clear blue, one day, my buddy gives me a note. He goes, hey, dude, you know that chick that don't, doesn't leave you alone? And I go, yeah, what about it? Uh, she, she told me to give this to you. And I go, what's this? He goes, I don't know. But all the guys were laughing. Well, well he gave me the note, and I go, y'all guys read this note. Y'all read this note, didn't y'all? He goes, no, dude, no, we didn't read it. Y'all read this note. So, I go to the corner, right, and I open up the letter. This is all true. I open it and it says, Dear Bobby Rebus, I'm going to have to break up with you, Bobby Rebus. I really like you, Bobby Rebus, but you don't give me the attention that I deserve, Bobby Rebus. You don't deserve me, Bobby Rebus. And I'm going like, <laughs> Hey, man. <laughs> okay. And so, this girl broke up with me when we weren't even going around. So ever since that day, I changed my name from Bobby Rebus to Robert Rebus, and the rest is history. There you go. To this day, people have asked me, hey, dude, whatever happened to that chick that was all infatuated with Bobby Rebus, right? I said, I found out she had 10 kids, and they're all called Bobby Rebus. There you go. So there you have it. 9.20 in the morning. I tell you what, I got to send a story for y'all. Here we go. Let's see what's going on here. Let me see here. Okay. I don't want to uh, Okay. Let me see here. There we go. Check this out. Crazy story. Cops. Uh, concerned cops got a startling surprise after rushing over to assist what they thought was a collapsed man after arriving on the scene, okay, in England, in England. After arriving on the scene in England this week, they discovered that it wasn't actually an injured person on the ground. It was a four-foot alligator. I didn't know they had alligator in England. Are you serious? And my sister, who lives in England, is inviting me to go over there. She goes, come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Come on to England. They got beautiful lakes, beautiful ponds. You can go swimming. You don't have to worry about alligators over here. I don't think so. I'm not going. <laughs> Can you imagine? Can you imagine that they found an alligator in England on the sidewalk? Right? How crazy is that? That's a cut, man. You know, I when I had lunch with my son yesterday, he goes, Dad, you don't get in the water, do you? And I go, hell no. He goes, why not? I said, look here, man. I'm not going to get in water where fish have been having sex. I'm not going to do it. And even more so, there could be alligators. There could be jellyfish. There could be sharks. And I'm a... You know, if you were to look at my body, man, I'm considered the catch of the day. Anyways, 9.22 in the morning. Mm -hmm. Let's get me going. They do some wang chung on this Thursday morning. Buenos dias. Double R Radio.